Hello and welcome everybody. This is Super Gem Fighter Mini Mix. <laughs> As you could probably tell, this is one of the classic games from Capcom's heyday. When arcades were at their prime worldwide and not just Japan. And we had just beautiful, beautiful games coming out in the, on the uh, arcades seemingly all the time. This game also came out on the PlayStation, as well as the Saturn, although the Saturn only got a, uh, only got a release in Japan. It is a cutesy, chibi style of uh, game. It features three buttons, a punch, a kick, and a special. Now you'd think that this sort of game would be very shallow, but in reality, the speed and the, uh, and the combos that you could do, combined with, a, uh, with an increased speed, help to give the game a little bit of depth and uh, what is at first thought of as a uh, game for kids is given quite a bit of depth. Now there are, as you can see, there are 12 characters, including these two hidden ones. And where do we start? We're going to start with Ken for this video. Ken continues his training in America. But the honeymoon with Eliza has long since ended, and they've become a bit tired of each other lately. I love Eliza, but it would be kind of nice to have tea with another girl every once in a while. Tea. Yeah. Yeah, tea. That, that's, that's what you're after. Whatever, man. And so, Ken left in search of a beautiful girl. There's your story. And hey, search for a beautiful girl and you start with Zangief. He is neither. Okay, let me get uh And uh There's your combos. There's a special button. Now, another, uh... You may have noticed all the gems lying on the ground. Another, uh, shall we say, gimmick of this, uh, game is that you can use the gems to power up your moves. This makes up for the, uh, for the lack. for the lack of extra buttons. So yeah, it could get a little mashy. But it's still, you know, it's still quite fun. And if you're not careful, you can really get messed up. Even by the lowest standards, that was really bad. Yeah. Because, you know, it's not like it's the first fight or anything. And here's Sakura. Now you may have noticed, also, that the backgrounds are just replete with references. There's Kami trying to get a... trying to get a toy from Bison who's like, ah, man. There's Donovan's adoptive daughter. And we have Balrog in the background looking at a giant plush Chun-Li. <laughs> Got that ass. Uh, for this playthrough, I have, uh, 
I've set the, uh, the game to normal difficulty. As I don't want my ass just completely kicked. That'll make these videos last goddamn forever. Bitch. Yeah, she, which she's doing anyway. There we go. That was uh, that was harder than I would have liked. But yeah, there's tons of personality in this game. You'll never win with tiny kicks like yours. Uh, everybody's kicks are fucking tiny in this game. It's Pocket Fighter. And here is ah, Chun Li. Here we have, uh, DJ just getting funky. Oh, crap. Oh, hell no. Oh, hell, I just, I just knocked her into the damn gym. Come on. Yes. This may be a simplified Street Fighter somewhat, but it's still Street Fighter. So get used to those Hadouken uh, showdowns. And there's a... Uh... Thankfully, there's, there doesn't seem to be any chip in this game. Get down. That's another uh, little thing that uh, sets this game apart. Shit. You can knock things out for little gifts. Oh, crap. Whew! Survived that one. Ah, oh, crap. Now, even in a game like this, you've probably noticed I am not FGC uh, caliber. I have... An arcade stick that I made myself. But I mostly use it for uh, retro gaming. Which is probably what you'll see most of on this uh, channel. Oh, crap, crap, crap. Ooh, that was close. Get done. Damn, I fell for that again. Whew. Keep the hot oakens coming. I'm going to lame this the hell out. Back, back, back. Oh, hell. I managed to, to win uh, by actually beating her. And you'll notice even the uh, even the defeats in the game are Capcom references. Particularly the uh, the Mega Man explosion, the the bones which are from uh Goons Ghosts. I think God, I, th I think the water splash might go as far back as Mickey Mouse capade. 
Was that Capcom? I have to, I have to look. I need that. Get down. As far as I can tell, you have to you have to start with a punch for your combos. But they can be anything after that. Got your ass. Yeah, the uh the combo finishers and specials. Well, the special combo finishers, anyway, I mean, have a, uh, have a nice little effect where they'll knock gems out of your opponent and, uh, power down the moves. Granted, you get gems will be knocked out by hitting them in general, but only the specials will, will power someone down, like that. Come on, boy. Each character has a... Uh, has three special moves. One for each button. I think it's all double Hadouken motion and the button. Although that might just be for Ken. We're going to find out later on. That was pretty funny. Oh, you were being serious. You know, Ken... You're looking for beautiful girls. I don't think beating the crap out of them is the way to go. Just, you know, just me. I might, I might be wrong on that, you know, just, you know, anybody want to let me know? If you disagree, let me know. Here we go. All right. Come on, get some. Before anybody asks, yes, I'm using uh, MAME to play this. It's just a lot easier for me. Although I do have the PlayStation version. I think this game was also in the Alpha Collection on the PS2, which I also have. I'll have to take a look at that. But, uh, let me get this done. But I have issues with the Elgato software on Windows, where sometimes it'll just uh, freeze on me. And I'm sure you can understand why I wouldn't want to fucking uh, redo things over and over and over again, because the software is acting up. So I'm just using OBS on uh, Linux at the moment. Oh, hell no. Hey, he wanted me to hurry up. Bang. I have to, uh... I have to... Echo uh, Maximilian Dude's um, thoughts when he played as Ken uh, Puzzle Fighter some time back. Why haven't these games been... Uh, why weren't these games added to a collection of some sort? I mean... I mean, there's, there's no reason to think that the Street Fighter Anniversary Collection did poorly, even though it maybe should have. And the Beat-Em-Up Bundle seems to have done well as well. I've actually just ordered that from eBay. Unfortunately, I had to get an import version because it was digital only in America. So that will be my second import Switch game. Funny, it's called the Belt Action Collection, which I thought was weird. I don't know, I don't know. On the, on the off chance that there's somebody Japanese watching this, and I doubt it, but on the off chance, why the hell belt action? Is that what you guys call beat em ups over there? Ah, oh, there's Shenko crying. That's sad. Let's see who's next. Hey, look, it's Ryu. You know, another perfect target when you're looking for beautiful girls. Hey, there's Lilith, just hanging out. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, I can think of very few people you want with a, uh... 
with a full powered Hadouken less than friggin' re than the uh, Hadouken Fiend. And get that pizza. Yeah, th those life ups are a blessing. Well, at least I uh, didn't have to deal with this Hadouken. Ah, oh, hell. Well, fuck. Like I said, king of the fucking hot oakens here. Oh, hell no. And there goes Ryu. Oh, something I forgot to mention. If you look at the top, you'll notice instead of having the rounds, you'll have, uh, you have the character's, uh, losses put up as lives. So basically you get two lives. And you'll notice when, uh, you're down to your last life, the life is kind of sad. The little life icon. Which I thought was a like, cute little touch. I mean, this game is just full of... Full of cute shit like this, man. Ah, oh, hell. I, I ate that one. Oh, come on. Shit. Yeah. That wasn't gonna happen. Got him. Ooh, that was the that was hard. <laughs> Whew, that was pretty funny. Oh, you were being serious. Lifelong friends, everybody. Lifelong friends. Now we're back to the girls with Tessa, who is from Warzard slash Red Earth, which I've never played. I really should play that. Has that ever actually been released for home? I'm not sure. I saw the Mamer on once. I never got a, I never tried it. I really should. Get Jones. Oh, cut the fuck on. Oh, this guy's... This girl's kicking my ass. Damn. Whew. I lucked out on that one. I, I ain't even gonna lie. This is one of the fun parts of having a fully powered Hado. Can you just high open the piss out of people? You're gone. It's funny, I mash buttons on the, uh, on the Shinpyukya, on the, on the standing up, on the, uh, straight up Hado, uh, Shoryuken Super. And then, but then I realize, oh shit, there's no chip in this game. Whew. No matter. Beating on some asses. Even by the lowest standards, that was really bad. Cause you know it's not like uh, you know, it's not like you're any uh, you're hot shit beating up on witches and schoolgirls and shit like that. And here's Morrigan, which is Ken's boss. Hey there, Morgan. Interested in having a cup of tea with me sometime? Why not? But first, how about a sparring match? I'm so dreadfully bored. I know. How about you buy me a pair of shoes if I win, and a new outfit if I lose? Sure, that sounds... Wait! Ah, ah you got trapped, Ken! And there's Dimitri having a, having a gay old time. Oh, hell. How do you do that shit? There you go. 
I think it's kick and special to throw the items. Get your ass. Not that they really matter. It's so damn hard to hit them to the arc that they get thrown at. Grab that. Oh, come. Ooh, I, I dodged that one. Boom. Gotcha. You see, all the Dark Sarkers are having a great old time. Well, Dimitri and uh, his lady friends. Who are a lot more animated than they were in his Darkstalker stage. Whoa, shit. God, ah, oh, hell. Damn, she blocked it. Get some. Come on, get some. See what I mean about how hard it is to hit people with those damn items? Not that it matters, I won! We're done, and now it's time for the ending. And so, Ken was forced to go shopping with Moore again. <coughs> Sorry about that. I get that way when I talk a lot. Come on already, aren't you finished yet? My feet hurt. But you said you'd buy me some new clothes. There's Eliza. She looks pissed as fuck. But you said you'd buy me some new clothes. Just be glad I'm with you. Oh, let's try that store next. Boy, someone please put an end to my suffering. Little did he know, his suffering has only just begun. Ken, who is that girl? Eliza. Oh, no, wait. This is all a misunderstanding. We were just having tea, that's all, really. I've heard that line before. Take that! Ouch. Oh, well, he had the... He had the good sense to have his mouth guard on. That's that's good thinking there, Ken. Because uh, that's one hell of a punch. <laughs> that's what I like about this human world. Great clothes and lots of entertaining quarrels. Entertaining. Great. Anyway, that was a uh, was Super Gem Fighter Mini Mix. Ken. Now these are the, uh, the credits, obviously. And it's actually kind of cute, the credits, because they have these little, uh, these little intermission bits like you'd see in uh, Super Puzzle Fighter. Although, unfortunately, they seem to be the same ones every time you play, but they're the end credits. What do you want? Um, but it's, it's... The game is is fun. You know what I'm saying? Like... It's not as complex as a traditional Street Fighter game. But... <laughs> there goes Dan. Getting this shit just rocked. Um, <laughs> it's not as complex, but... It's a lot of fun. And it's not like you could just autopilot. Like, there's a lot of challenge to it. Especially if you bump it up a little bit. Like I said, I had it on normal for the... Uh... There goes Dan again. There's a lot of challenge. You can't just autopilot it, and you can really, you can really get good. At, you can really get into the game. I mean, you know, it, it's a game that I'd recommend for anybody, either, um, either the PlayStation version or the Japanese Saturn version. There goes, uh, there goes uh, Zangief. But yeah, it, it's. Uh, I, I can't say enough about this. This is fun. 
That's what's up. This is just fun. And ain't enough just fun games out there, man. Uh, where'd the water go? Oh, shit. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm gonna try to do all the characters. You know, just get the, um... Get the whole roster in, so we can see all the endings. Up, oh, poor Felicia. And, uh, I'm not sure if that's revenge, Chun-Li. You know, Dan's in a lot of these, I noticed. I mean, I get he's the joke character, but damn, you know? Capcom all stuff, woo! Rita Rokos. That's a name. Thank you for playing. Presented by Capcom. Oh, shit. Thank you for making the game, Capcom. It was fun. Uh, let's uh, do that. And with that, we are done. Thank you for watching the show, and I hope to see you again soon. Have a good one. God bless.